What is going on guys and girls, my name is Van Gilf. Today we have got an informed Damianovic player review. Before we get into the player review guys, if you're looking for cheap coins at variable rates like 10k, 50k and 100k, you can now buy from the game keys. Use my code VAN at the checkout for a 5% discount. A link to everything will be in the description below. As you can see now, we've uh, played 6 games with him, we've got 6 goals. As you can see, we're looking at his in-game stats now. He's got some pretty decent stats. A standout stat is going to be the 95 finishing there. He's got an absolutely insane right boot on him guys. His shot power is pretty pretty good as well that stands at 87 by the looks of things and he's not too shabby at the volume as well he's got high low work rate so in my opinion that's perfect for a striker it's you know that's obviously perfect for a striker he's got four star weak foot three star skill moves so you can do the roulettes you can do the step overs pretty damn well with him as you can see he's pretty damn strong the only problem there was his balance his lack of balance isn't always the best especially when he's attempting some shots if he's off balance he probably does fall over which is quite annoying basically Damjanovic is a perfect target man in my opinion you can give the ball to his feet, he can hold off defenders, he can turn, he can shoot. But the thing is, I actually found myself playing over the top balls to him, and he was actually succeeding. I mean, his strength helps him beat the defenders to the ball, and this is an absolutely cheeky effort. I actually chipped that, and I thought it was going in. I was going crazy. But as you can see here, he's got a great shot on him. Whenever he comes towards the goal, you know, he's got his eyes on getting a goal. And to be honest with you, he can put the ball into the corners very well. I mean, look at that. He's just... He's just great at getting first to the ball. I mean, his first touch is actually really good as well. I compare him to Dzeko, to be honest with you. I really like Dzeko in this game. Dzeko, Mandzukic, you know, any kind of players like that. Maybe even Diego Costa. Yeah, I think he might actually feel a little bit faster than Diego Costa, to be honest with you. When I used Diego Costa, he wasn't the fastest of all players in my opinion but Damjanovic felt a little bit quicker uh, as you can see here he's got a beautiful finish on him that plus 90 finishing stat really does stand out on this inform card I actually used Damjanovic's team of the season card last year and it was one of my favorite cards on the game so when this inform card came about I really wanted it to be good and I'm so happy that it was good we're just going to come to the end of the shooting now with a beautiful goal um, I'm going to look at his heading now guys and I have to say his heading was pretty decent although I think they have nerfed heading so much on the new gen because I just only, I only managed to score one. All the other headers that I got were saved by the keeper. This one I was shocked at. It's a brilliant save. Brilliant reaction save there by the goalkeeper and he was good at winning the headers. He was good at flicking the ball onto the other strikers. That's one problem I did encounter with him. The fact that the, you, you're basically limited, limited to what strikers you can have with him. You can either have Vukinic or Jovetic and you've got to try and get some sort of strong link in there. Last year, you could have maybe two links and he would be fine with the chemistry. 3-5-2 last year, Jovetic, um, Vukinic and Damjanovic up front was so, so lethal. This year, for some reason, I just could not get it linked in. And the reason I slowed this clip down, guys, is passing and he did an overhead pass to Vukinic. How fucking awesome is that? He's great at passing. He got a couple of assists for me, I think, if not one. I think one of them didn't even count, to be honest, on the record. But basically, guys, I'm, I'm going to give him a massive 9 out of 10 because he's one of my favourite strikers so far in the game. He's great at shooting. He's got very strong. He's not the slowest of players. You know, it's very slightly. I might put that as like a slight, slight problem. Uh, same goes for his league and nation. They're not great for hybrids. Other than that, everything for me is spot on. And uh, as well, he's got beautiful long hair, so why don't you want him in your team? He's just a perfect target, man. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave the video here. He also cost 14 k so it was an absolute bargain. Um, if you have enjoyed this video, guys, if you're new around here, leave a like, comment, and as always, subscribe. What do you want me to upload tomorrow as well? I need you to leave a comment telling me because I don't know which one to upload. I've either got a Legends hybrid with three Legends, or I could upload the legendary Suka player of you. He's a striker who plays for Croatia, um, or played for Croatia, played for many different leagues as well, and many different teams in different leagues like Arsenal etc etc um, leave a comment saying which one you would prefer tomorrow and I will get that done for you thanks for watching and goodbye